I went to Walgreens trying to find the best deal on Pokemon cards and I found these. Now originally I was looking for the Cosmic Eclipse packs but I found these and said why not let's give it a try. So let's see what we can find. And make sure you guys stick around to the end because honestly this is the best thing that's ever happened on this channel. I couldn't believe it and you won't either. Here we go. One, two, three. Oh my fucking... Oh my god! <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the Poke Rage channel. And um, so yeah, as I said earlier, I was trying to find the packs that came with the Cosmic Eclipse packs in them, but unfortunately all they had was the Evolving Skies. Now, they come with the Evolving Skies and a Chilling Rain pack inside, which isn't too bad, honestly. I think these retailed for about $14, I think. So, I mean, you know, it's a little much. I think Honestly, why it's more is just because you get this little uh, Celebi, Celebi pin. Um, I think the other one, yeah. So the other one, there's two different ones. I got Celebi and then there's a Jirachi pin. I think the Cosmic Eclipse ones came with the same exact pins. Um, but yeah, so I bought them uh, a couple weeks ago. And so I was like, you know what? Hopefully uh, we can pull some sort of Umbreon or Rayquaza. Uh, but before I begin, uh, please leave a like, uh, hit that subscribe button, and then let me know below um, if you guys are going to pick these up from Walgreens. So, yeah, um, I guess we're just going to start right into it. Um, like I said, there's Evolving Skies and a uh, Chilling Rain pack inside of these. Um, these might be kind of annoying to open, but we'll see. I can never... There we go. All right, we'll just... There we go. Rah! There we go. Rip right into it. Yeah, destroy the cards! <laughs> so anyway, yeah, so Chilling Rain, Evolving Skies, um, and then this little Celebi pin. It's not too bad. So, um, I mean, I don't collect pins, so I, I don't really know what to do with these. I usually just kind of keep them on the shelf behind me back there. Um, here, we'll, we'll put them on, we'll put them over there and that you can really see them. We'll get this garbage out of the way. Um, I think what I'm gonna do, no, nah, well, you know what, no, we'll just, we're gonna start with the Chilling Rain, um, so I think I missed before, like, one of the best cards, probably the Blaziken VMAX in this set, too, that's going for well over $100, um, uh, the Galarian Moltres alternate art is always good, and the Golden Snorlax, Golden Snorlax is, I think, around $70 to $80, I think, now, um, so... Yeah, I think this was another set that, you know, people got tired pretty quickly. Um, I, I don't know. It kind of came and went, I feel like, in my opinion, but, you know, it's okay. We'll see what we got here. Kubfu, Sabo, Frostlass, and a Zarude Hollow. So, nothing good in that pack. Not surprised. <laughs> and Evolving Skies, and I'm... It would be even, you know, we don't even need the Unbounded Closet. Any of like the Evolutions, Leafeon, Glaceon alternate arts, those are, those are awesome looking cards too. I don't know why everyone sleeps on those cards. Um, but, uh, something tells me that we're not going to get those. So, um, let's just get into it. Lotad, Sableye, Teddy Ursa, Mareep, Zerua. Gigalith and a first on hollow. <laughs> a shift tree. There it is. All right. And on hollow. So two bullshit packs right off the bat. All right. So, all right. So this one comes with the Jirachi pin. Um, again, I don't, I don't know what people, I mean, do you guys put them on your clothes? Do you put them on backpacks? Like, I, I don't, I don't really know what to do with all these pins. I have like a container full of them from like buying those special sets that come with the pins like the Arceus pins or like the Dialga pins or something. But yeah, there's Jirachi, he's happy, chilling, whatever. And okay, I'm gonna put him over there. So those two might be the only thing going back on that wall because God knows hits in this channel are slim to none. <laughs> so yeah, here we go. Chilling Rain pack number two. I am so excited to see what we get. Aren't you guys? Cast form, Quillfish, Ralts, Heracross. These cards feel incredibly thin, and I don't know why. That is really weird. Um, I'm almost tempted to do the rip test on them. You know what? Maybe I will. And oh, there is our second non hollow Ampharos. Perfect. That's what we want to see. We want to see all the non hollows. And you know what? Let's fucking see. What do we got? Oh, no. There's, there's an ink line there. So we're good. These are real. <laughs> 
These are real. <laughs> Whatever. All right, here we go. Evolving Skies. Let's go with Sylveon. Sylveon is gonna get... What the Syl... What is Sylveon's alternate art? I honestly, God, don't remember what Sylveon's art looks like. I don't, I don't even know. It doesn't matter. We're not gonna see it anyway. Pokemon, Pikachu, Rufflip, Hopip, Hitmonchan, Switching Cups, and another non hollow. Yes, Gorgeist. He's my favorite non hollow out of every set that I've ever opened. Definitely bullshit. Okay, here we go. <laughs> On to something number three. You know, I, I, uh, this is why I stick to buying the singles after a while. You know, it's just so fucking stupid. Stupid, the, the pull rates, how bad they are sometimes. Like, I haven't, I, I'm still waiting for a Crown Zenith uh, shipment to come in. I think it's like two booster boxes and like the Minutons that are coming out. Um, but I haven't bought, I've seen st uh, the ETBs in stores and stuff. I haven't bought them because they're 50 bucks and you know what's going to happen is I'm going to buy them and nothing is going to come out of it. So I'm like, I could have spent that 50 bucks on like towards a fucking card that I want. But, you know. That's not gonna happen, or, you know, we'll wait. We'll wait till we see what happens. I think the Pikachu thing comes out, the Pikachu VMAX comes out on Friday and with the 10th. So yeah, the 17th, I got a couple days. So Aaron, Venipede, and our fourth not hollow. Yes, a uh, past minion. Okay, cool. Now, I know you guys come to this channel to watch the non hollow opening, see how many we can get a record fucking breaking mount in each one. I wouldn't really count the Scarlet and Violet ones. I think, so, after opening the Scarlet and Violet packs, I noticed that the, it was like the same amount of hits. So it was like seven hollows, four EXs, the one secret art rare, and the, and then it was like 13 non hollows. Uh, it was the same on each box. So I just, I didn't put the counter in the last video because it's all the same. So I'm sorry. All right, cool, cool. Hypno and our fifth non hollow. Oh, no, it's an actual hollow. It's a Raichu. If you guys can believe it, we got a Raichu. Nothing good. Um, yeah. Fuck you, Raichu. God damn it. All right, here we go. Pack number four. I can't believe I bought five of these. What I should have done is just kept them sealed, but you know what? What's the point, right? This is an opening channel, and we want to see if we can get anything good. Because if we ever do anything, get anything good in this channel, it'll be the most surprising thing in the fucking world. Everyone will go crazy. Everyone, everyone in the world will react and like, we're all gonna clap at the end. All right, here we go. Another Zapdos uh, pack art, I think. They've all been Zapdos. I haven't really been paying attention, but it kind of looks like it. Whatever, who cares? <laughs> so, these Zapdos and. What is, what is this? Art, there's five art works or art packs? I don't know. Articuno. All right, here we go. Shuppet, Cub Fu, Blitzel. Quillfish, Slowpoke, there we go, and Volcarona, yeah, wow, that is amazing, you guys see that, Volcarona, holy shit, it's like he's popping right off the fucking card itself, next fucking pack, Evolving Skies, here we go, Umbreon, we're gonna pull the Umbreon out of the Umbreon pack, wow, this is gonna be... You guys are in for the ride of your life soon. I'm telling you right now, this is going to be so good. You, you're going to wish you stayed for the whole video. Psyduck, Swablu, Dot, Sharpedo, and another non hollow Flapple. That is awesome. Cool. All right. So out of eight packs, we've pulled six non hollows. Very good. Very good. That's what I love to see here. Um, so, you know what? Yeah, let's just get into this is it this is our last pack are you guys ready for this last pack magic on both of these gold cards alternate arts they're all gonna show up and like i said look at this the five pins are the most exciting goddamn thing on this fucking video all right here we go chilling rain oh we got the fucking shadow rider we got a different artwork you know what that means we're definitely going to get an alternate art on this one alternate art moltres this is this is it. You're in for the ride of your lives, boys and girls, because this is this is where it happens. This is where all the magic happens. Lapras, Blitzel, Aaron, Deerling, Delibird, and a non-hollow Agron. Yes! This is oh my god, we're going for the world record. 
if Guinness Book of World Records does not have a, a non hollow counter, like out of how many packs, they need to get one. Most non hollow pulls in a YouTube channel. This is good. This is the one that wins. This is this is it. Okay, here we go. All right, last pack of the day. Teddy Ursa, Feebas, Hopip, Hitmonchan, Fletchling, Bravery Ari. All right, this is it. You guys ready? Here we go. One, two, three. Oh my! Oh my god! No, no, no! Oh my god! This is a goddamn joke. No way did this actually happen. <laughs> Get out of my face. This is... <laughs> Stop. <laughs> They're playing a joke on me. <laughs> oh my god. Amazing. Well, this is... <laughs> we actually pulled an alternate art... Evolution, best pull by far on this channel. I cannot believe it. I have to look up how much this is going for now, but I know it's well over a hundred dollars. This is absolutely the best. I cannot believe that this actually happened. <laughs> Last pack magic. It actually is a thing. I cannot believe it. Last pack magic. Oh my god. Oh shit. Well guys, um <laughs> this is too good. I was a, I, I was joking. I really didn't think this was going to happen. <laughs> Just leave this guy up. I mean, it's well worth it. I think, you know, what I spent on these packs, this is this is definitely well worth it. I mean, the centering isn't amazing. It's probably like a 9 centering. <clears throat> It's like thicker on the right on the left side here, but yeah, I mean this is the back centering is really good, um, not too bad on that. But <laughs> this is great. This is actually great. All right, well that's gonna do it for me on this video. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Um, please, like I said, subscribe to the channel if you can. Leave a like, and uh, yeah. Tell me tell me what you guys thought of this because nobody saw this coming. I definitely didn't see this coming This is I haven't pulled a good card like this in such a long time. So Until the next one. I will see you guys later and uh, yeah, bye